What's up, Break Native Devs? My name is Vojta. You might know me as Vonovac on GitHub or on Twitter. And I have built a library called Rake Native Theme Control, which I want to share with you today. All right, so let me show you through an example what this library is good for. I have built a very simple app. Um, I used the use color scheme hook to find out what the active color scheme is. And then based on that, I'm controlling the background color as well as the text color. So right now, because the color scheme is light, that means I have a light background and black text. And apart from these uh, simple React Native views, uh, there is a few more interesting ones, like for example, this native UI menu. And the styling of this, the, the colors here, are controlled really by the operating system settings. Let me expand on this. In the settings, you'll know that there's a way to change between light and dark theme. And right now you see that the active theme is light because Safari is light as well as my app. But I can change this. I can use the keyboard shortcut command shift A to toggle between light and dark. The React Native Core gives you the use color scheme hook, which you can use to read whatever the currently active color scheme is. And this actually influences much more things than you might think. Apart from the colors of the background and the text, it also influences the appearance of the native UI menu. Or for example, when I focus a text input, you'll see that the keyboard design is light and the scroll bar is dark. And when I open a file picker, it has a light background. Now, if I change this to the dark mode, obviously the colors have changed, but also when I open a, open a menu, it's gonna be dark when I focus a text input, the keyboard design has changed. Also, the scroll bar is now light, so that it's more visible on the dark background. And finally, when I open a file picker, it's going to be on a black background. These are things that you cannot control from JavaScript. And this is where React Native Theme Control comes into play. So it gives you a way to force the currently active theme so if I open up the app switcher, you'll see that Safari is, is light and my app is dark. And regardless of how I change the system settings, my app is staying in the, in the dark design. So React Native Theme Control gives you the way to force the application theme. And it also gives you a, a way to find out whatever the user preference is. So right now it's dark, it can be light, and when there is no user preference, it's going to be automatic by default. There are a few more useful things inside of my library, so please do check it out and let me know if you find it helpful. Thanks for watching.